In this session, we are going to study problems on Markov source. Study the problems on Markov source. Okay. So for the first order, for the first order, Markov model as shown. find state probabilities find state probabilities entropy of each state and entropy of source Okay, let me write the state diagram. We have three states. This is the state diagram. Now, using the state diagram, I have to write the state equations. So, let me write the state equations. Okay. So, for state A, let me write the state equation first for state A. I will write for state A. It is nothing but P of A. P of A means arrows going to state A. So it is 0 0.2 of PA. It is in the same state with probability 0 0.2. Okay. What else is coming to state A? 0 0.2 from state C plus 0 0.2 P of C. Call this as equation 1. So how will I write a state equation for state A? Which is inverting inward arrow to A. So, inward arrow to A is A in its own state with probability 0.2 and C going to state A with probability 2. So, arrows pointing towards A state is taken. Next, for state B, P of B equal to, for state B, 0.2 P of B, 0.2 P of B, we can see 0.2 P of B. Plus invert arrow towards B, 0.3 B of C. Call this as equation 2. Next, for state C, it is P of C, which is equal to 0.5 P of C. It is in its own state, 0.5 P of C. Plus, which is going to, what is coming to state C? 0.5 P of A, 0 0.8, 0 0.8 P of B. So we have 0.8 P of B. We can see here 0 0.8 P of B, arrow inverting towards C, plus it is 0 0.5 P of P of A. This is equation. So from equation 1, from equation 1, we can write 1 minus 0.2. That is 0.8 P of A equal to 0.2 P of C. Or P of A equal to 1 by 4 P of C. This is my equation 4. So I write P of A equal to 1 by 4 P of C. That is equation 4. This is from equation 1 I have got. Next from equation 2, from equation 2, I get 0 0.8 P of B equal to 0.3 P of C. That is, this is 1 minus 0 0.2, 0 0.8. So now P of B equal to 3 by 8 P of C. Call this as equation 5. I have to find the 
probability of each state and entropy of each state and entropy of the source. Three states, P of A, P of B, P of C I have to find. Next. So, but we have three states, probability of all should be equal to one. This we know. Okay. So, now what is P of A? One by four P of C. You can see here one by four P of C plus P of B is three by eight P of C plus P of C equal to one. From this equation, I get P of C is equal to eight by 13. So I got the probability of the state C. Once I get the probability of state C, from equation 4 and 5, I get P of A and P of C. What is P of A? 1 by 4 P of C, which is 1 by 4. What is P of C? 8 by 13. Now this will be equal to 2 by 13. P of B equal to P of B equal to 3 by 8 P of C. 3 by 8 P of C, which is equal to 3 by 8 into 8 by 3, which is equal to 3 by 13. So now I got entropy, I got probability of each state. What is P of A? 2 by 13. What is P of B? 3 by 13. P of C? 8 by 30. These are the probability of each state. After finding the probability, I have to find entropy of each state. So entropy of each state means let me find first entropy of state A. Which is our H of A. How will I find H of A? This is equal to summation 3 states. P A J log of 1 by P A J. Okay. So first J is A. So P A A log of 1 by P A A plus J is B because A B C three states. A B when J is C. P A A. What is the probability of P A A? P A A. 0.2. Correct? From the state diagram. So I write this as 0.2 log of 1 by 0.2 plus P A B. A to B. A to B you can see there is no probability. State diagram there is no connection. A to C. From the state diagram we see A to C. 0.5. From the probability, we can see A to A. Next, you can see A to C. What is A to C? It is 0.5. So now I write that as 0.5 log of 1 by 0.5. This is equal to 0 0.722 bits per message symbol okay so a to c next entropy of state b which is h of b this is h b a using the same equation log of p b a this is p b a log of p b a plus PBB log of 1 by PBB plus PBC log of 1 by PBC. What is PBA? There is no connection between B to A or A to B. We have seen from the state diagram. So I'll substitute that as 0. PBB, B to B, what is that probability? 0.2. So I'll substitute 0 0.2 log of 1 by 0 0.2 plus B to C. B to C, B to C, I'm able to see 0 0.8. So this is 0 0.8 log of 1 by 0 0.8. So I get 0 0.722, H of B also, 0 0.722 bits 
message symbol. Next, I will find entropy of state C. So, which is H of HC, PCA, log of 1 by PCA plus PCB plus PCC. PCA, C2A, 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 point 2. So I will substitute point 2, log of 1 by point 2, C2B, where is C2B? C2B is point 3, you can make out here point 3. Plus C to C from the state diagram, C to C is 0.5. So HC will be equal to 1.485 bits per message symbol. Next, now I want entropy of state source. Entropy of source, which is H of S is equal to summation I is A to C, PI, HI. So it is PA, HA, plus P of B, HB, plus P of C, HC. What is PA? 2 by 13. What is HA? 0 0.722. PB is 3 by 13. This is 0 0.722. This is entropy of each state we have determined. This is probability of each state we have determined. Next, PC is 8 by 13. And this is just now determined 1.485. So I get entropy of the source 1.192 bits per message symbol. So for the given state diagram, for the given state diagram, first I write the state diagram, I write the state equations for each states given to me by making use of the inward arrow that goes to the each state. Next, using the relations from the equation, I find the probability of each state. After finding probability of each state, I find the entropy of each state by using the probabilities. Then I find the entropy of the entire source, which is probability of each state into entropy of each state. 